Alright, so this is a video I've been meaning to make for like a couple months now. I just haven't really, I don't know, I haven't really been making videos for this page. Basically, I'm just going to cover real quick what the best bumper is. The best Z01 style bumper for the 6th gen SS. Basically, I had two different ones. The first one I had was i5 Auto House. And the second one, the one that I have now, is Icon Motorsports. So originally with the i5 Auto House one, it was a little cheaper, but at the time that I bought it, it was like almost the end of 2020. It was like October, September 2020. And there was literally no other aftermarket Z01 bumpers that would fit my car because my car is a 2020 and the 19s and 20s, the way the lights are, the top grill doesn't fit from other bumpers. So I had to wait for a new one to come out. So basically I just bought the first one I seen, which was i5 Auto House and they were like they were nice at first with the everything they they sent it out quick i got it painted put like went to put it on the car and then when i put it on the car it did not fucking line up like like there was a big ass gap on one side and then the hood had like a weird it, it was not flush at all and then the top grill kept falling out i don't know what the fucking problem was but the top grill kept coming out like it kept popping out when i'm driving so eventually they sent me a new top grill after I showed them pictures and videos and everything. And then I go to put that top grill in and the, that one does the same exact thing. And like throughout this whole process, I took the bumper off. Like me and my buddies took the bumper off probably like four or five times. And I kept sending them pictures and videos and they were just telling me I don't know how to do it. And my buddy who's a mechanic doesn't know how to do it. And I was like, bro, what do you fucking mean? Like dog, like... <laughs> And you could just look at the bumper, like, it just looked, to me, it always looked cheap. I'll, I'll pull up a picture right now. Like, if you zoom in on the front, just, like, the bottom grill, I don't like that design on it. I like the DRLs, though. That that was nice. Like, the lights on the side, the running lights. But it just looked cheap to me. And the fitment wasn't good. And the top grill kept popping out. And it was just, like, a headache. So, eventually, I bought, as soon as it came out, I bought the Icon Motorsports one. That was definitely the best. That was the best move. Soon, bro, they shipped it mad quick. Came here. They were like, yeah, you need anything else? Like, they were like, good support, bro. Like, <laughs> and then I got it painted, put right on. No fitment issues at all. It fit perfect. Went right on. It looks solid. Like, you can see in the videos and the pictures I'm showing right now. Like, it looks well put together. Like, it's textured. Like, the grills are textured. Like, if you touch them, the canards are textured. It's like a... It's weird, but it's, like, cool, though. Like, it's high-quality stuff. It was a little more than the i5 one, but it's definitely worth it. It was, like, 100 200 bucks more. Like, bro, really, it's not that bad. The only thing I wish this one had that the other one had is the DRLs, but it's not really, like, a make-or-break type thing because it, it still looks sweet, though, and it fits perfectly on mine. And another thing I found out with this one, you could put the top grill from a stock bumper on it. So, like... What I'm probably going to end up doing is buying another 2020 grill and the Chevy logo and putting the Chevy logo and the grill on this bumper so it looks just like a regular bumper. Because I bought the Flow Tie, but Z01s don't have the headlight style that the SS's, the 19 and 20s do. So basically it just doesn't fit on there. I just wanted to make this video real quick and let y'all know my thoughts. Definitely I would save the money and the headache and, and go with the Icon Motorsports bumper. I would just rock out with the stock bumper honestly because they even make canards for it now. Like, that was my biggest thing when I wanted to buy it was the Canards, because that shit just looks sick, bro. It looks mean. Like, driving around, bro, that shit looks mean. Yeah, I mean, that's all I really got to say. I will go with the Icon Motorsports over the i5 Auto House bumper. Hope this helps y'all. Saves y'all some money. All right. Peace.